the ways in which an artist is not just a painter or not just a sculptor, and there's a lot of talent that's involved in those two things, but also how an artist is a storyteller, um, much in the same way that a novelist is or a writer is. It's just that the, the novelist works with a certain set of tools, uh, primarily words and the way that they string those together. And an artist works with a certain set of tools also. And the way that they construct their paintings is a way in which they can bring you into a different world, a world hopefully that they're introducing you to. And just like an, a writer, the first thing a writer has to do really is not kind of sit down and think about well, how many nouns am I going to use or how many verbs am I going to use or adjectives. You got to figure out that, well, this is a subject that I want to work with and if I'm going to be knowledgeable about that subject, I have to do a lot of research. So I have to know a lot before I ever put, um, I was going to say pen to paper, but nobody does that anymore. it will be the first time that you touch a keyboard, I guess. Uh, an artist has to do much the same thing. If you haven't thoroughly researched your subject, I can guarantee you if there's something in your painting that's sort of out of sync or that it's not authentic or that doesn't match that time period, someone's going to note it and someone's going to call your attention to that.